and today we are going to learn how to plot different bar color under a time series so the problem that we have is that we would like to plot a time series of AOD for example and then at each time step uh, it is assigned to a specific cluster for example from 1 to 9 and we would like to um, plot a histogram under the time series however each cluster has a different color so the the result of this tutorial will be then an image like this one where we have iod in the y-axis and the time step in the x-axis so you can see we have a time series and the fluctuation of iod throughout the the day the time step and then we also have at each time step it will be assigned to specific cluster so it has different color here and yeah the first thing that we need to do is we import the library we have numpy pandas matplotlib and then we open the csv file the data that i have here is the csv file and and we use the command pd pd stands for panda.csv file to read the the csv file one of the most not most but very important things that when we do the data analysis we need to open and see what the data is about and what do we have in this data so in order to do that we use a print df command so when when we use uh, print the df then we see this is a table where we have three main columns index iod and cluster so at each cluster let's say it's from one to nine and then at each time step it will be assigned to a certain number stands for that cluster we can also print out the keys uh, which is the column name and by using the df.keys here and the next step is that we are going to process and plot the data so because we have nine clusters so that we uh, will have nine different colors as in the list color here and then we extract the value uh, index as the x value and iod as a y as a y value we plot a bar and uh, plot the time series uh, note that the bar here have uh, the same of the color is the same with the blue color the next step is that i would like to find um, um, at each clusters and for example in this table i would like to find the index uh, corresponding to the cluster number one and for example you can see here all of the uh, cluster corresponding to the number one is at this index and in order to do that we will use the loop from uh, one to ten uh, one from one to ten because uh, it will look from the, the cluster number one to cluster number nine and then after that is we record the index of each specific cluster and store it into a list uh, the name of the list is x index here and this just a print print command to check whether we are doing right or wrong and then the next step is that we plot the bar uh, note that we already plot a bar, a bar plot here. Now this bar plot will overlap and the the previous bar plot so we have from zero to nine because the now the in the x index uh, uh, list is go from zero to nine, and then we can also add the label and the title for our our plot. And yeah, this is the final figure and it look uh, it just it is just artificial data so um, but it, it's look uh, you can customize and decorate to make it more beautiful uh, for your own problem yeah it is all done thank you very much for watching um, please feel free to let me know if you have any other analysis that you would like me to do and please please surprise my youtube channel too thank you very much